so it's officially been 10 weeks since we've started college and since then I think there has been so many changes and I would just like to talk about that. So the letter I'm focusing is R for relationships and some of the weeks that we discussed this were 5 and 8. Week 5 we talked about our comfort zones and more specifically getting out of them especially in a new environment like college and what I took away from that was essentially to get more involved and be open to whatever may come. So this example here is when Anna and I went to the festival they were having at the Union for I think it was Hispanic Heritage Month. We dropped in and we had some tacos. I didn't get her in the shop because I, you know, privacy and all that. So this other example is from the Rainbow Ball that my friend and I went to. And of course, the homecoming festival that went on. And in week eight, we talked about our design teams. We were able to sit down and think of everyone who is in our support systems, essentially. This week was focused on connecting with people and our relationships with them. And what I took away from this was to just be mindful of who is in my support system and who I can include and who is, you know, good for each part of the design team that we chose. So something that's meant a lot to me is honestly the personal growth that I've been able to achieve with this new independence. And coming into college, I didn't think that my fears and my inhibitions would affect me more than they did. I figured that I've already done so much growth and that I would be okay. But obviously there is always something new to learn. And so going to college, um, it's, been, it's been definitely a test of holding on to my confidence and not letting my old fears come back and take over my life. So something that I should probably spend a little more time on is just holding on to my confidence and just making sure that it doesn't falter as I get out of my comfort zone more and more. So all that's left to do now is just to keep growing as a person.